Hello friends. Welcome to Dissect's Learning by Doing Sessions. Here, we bring to you activities which you can do either by using our D-Box, or by collecting material yourself. In case you have not subscribed to our channel please subscribe and hit the bell icon to get all updates. In this video, we bring to you a short activity to help you understand about contour line maps. Here, Tixi seems to be puzzled and looks confused. Tixi's teacher has asked her to show a stack of books placed on table on a paper. Tixi gets an idea, that we can show the height, length and width of books on paper by making rectangles as shown. We have 1, 2, 3 and 4 books so we need to draw 4 concentric rectangles. But, we also need to show heights of the books, so that person who looks at the picture understands it in detail. Next, we can measure the height of all the books and mark on paper. Let's mark top of table as 0. Using a scale let's measure height of first book, which comes to 6 cm. We will write this on the first rectangle. Now, measure height of next book, which comes to 12 cm, again mark the same on paper as shown. Continue the same for all the books and mark all measurement on paper. So, now what we have got on the paper can be called as contour line map of books. But, what if we have a regular shape like a mountain? How can we make a contour line map of a mountain? We would like to hear your ideas on the same. Hope you liked our video, which shows a simple way to understand use of contour line map. You can now try this method for various things, and come up with your own contour line maps. Stay tuned in for more such learning by doing videos. If you liked our video, please like and share with your friends. If you have still not subscribed to our channel, please do subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon to get all updates. See you soon. Bye.